What's going on everyone? Welcome back to the channel. So iOS 13.2 just came out today and it's a pretty big update for sure. It brought a lot into it, but some of the features aren't necessarily dedicated towards a phone like an iPhone SE if I'm being completely honest. But most of the, I would say about like 75% of the features are, so that's really cool. But one of the major features is actually Deep Fusion and the addition of Deep Fusion into the camera. So it doesn't really affect the SE at all, but it does affect the iPhone 11 and 11 Pro. So those newer iPhones do have new camera capability within them and I thought you were able to change the camera quality in the app but I guess not I wasn't able to see that which is weird but with that deep fusion it adds a lot more capability within the camera which is always good to see now if you guys remember not too long ago with Apple they did that little Siri thing where they were like letting contractors listen to private conversations within Siri you were able to turn it off I, and I, as far as I know, I don't think you were able to opt out of it as far as I know, but they let you know, I guess, in their terms of service. They weren't really hiding it, but they were kind of at the same time. But now when I was going through my setup for my phone, I was able to, you know, you're able to opt out. That's one of the little things they show up when you're going through and you're, you know, going through the setup on your phone. And I saw that and I was like, why would anybody opt into that? Like I was reading it and it was like, share your Siri recordings to Apple or something like that. Share your Siri information to Apple. So it was something like that. And I'm like, I forgot about that while I was setting that up, but that reminded me of it. And I'm like, why would anybody opt into that? You know? And it was so weird seeing it. Like it was like an easy no for me. Maybe you're into it. Maybe you want to help Apple like that, but I would not listen. I would not let th these random people listen to things that I'm telling Siri or something like that. So that's, that's me. That's not everybody. But with 13.2, we did see the addition of some new emojis, which is always fun to see. As far as I know, like I told the last video, like I wasn't able to see too many new ones. There were some new food ones, but I only go through like the face emoji. That's the only ones I use. I don't really go too far into it, but if you guys see any new ones, let me know. You guys can pause the video and see them. I'll go ahead and keep going, but that's really cool. I love seeing the new emojis. That's really awesome, I guess. And now with HomePod support, you can actually go, which was already enabled before, you can now connect to multiple HomePods at the same time, which I love seeing seeing that type of improvement you know, within iOS and Apple said they were going to do it, they eventually did. That's one thing they always do, they always kind of prolong these features, but it's cool, it gives you something to look forward to in the future. So ultimately, that, those are the main things I wanted to hit on. I did run a multi-core score, and I'm not gonna lie, it's been a minute since I ran a multi-core score, but recently I just got a score of 130,256. This has to be the last one though, 124,157. Yeah, that's probably the one I screenshotted later. Or earlier today so it went up a little bit if this is accurate but this is the score I'm getting now and it's a decent score it's a little bit less than my iPhone success but it's still good enough for me you know the speed and performance is still very good as you guys can see I mean I've had no issues running anything on this phone it's been a very good phone so far so that's pretty much it if you guys have any questions or anything leave it down in the comment section below hit that like button that would mean so much but definitely hit that subscribe button every single subscriber that we get really does count so it'll mean so much if you guys can hit that also check out the other links down in the description as well my twitter my instagram my second channel all those links are linked down below i'd really appreciate it if you guys could check it out but more importantly than everything else i love every single one of you guys hopefully i'll catch you guys in the next video peace out to them